Sir from Export, welcome to the channel. In today's video, we're going to discuss the proper grip for Indian clubs. The correct grip on your Indian clubs is important because it's going to affect the amount of control you've got over the club. Okay? So lately I've seen quite a few instructors, even some of our previous instructors, demonstrating that you should be holding the club with the pommel in the center of the hand. And that basically removes two digits out of the equation, okay? There's no contact here. So you basically got three fingers in contact with the handle versus to the proper grip, which is a full hand, five digits, more control over the handle. Regardless that you're in a static position or when the club is in motion in the saber grip, okay? Now, the other type of grips that you'll find, the snake grips, um, you know, the ones you use for fancy uh, swinging where you're holding on to the knob and so on, they're fine. From a skills perspective, it's, it's nice to, do, or to be able to do these, uh, these patterns, but from a health joint perspective, really, you don't need that, okay? Sticking to the hard-shaped swings, the big circles, multiple plane movement is going to get you where you need to be. Now... Can you imagine yourself swinging heavier club? This one's about six kilos with just this amount of purchase on the club, okay? No, you want a full grip on the club to make sure you hold it. It's the same as if you're using any kind of tool, right? If you're working around a house on the weekend, I hope, really sincerely hope, that you're not holding on to a hammer to impress your wife like this, okay? Not gonna work. Full grip, any tool is the same. You'll see this in, you know, nobody holds a sword fully at the end like this, you know. Yeah, to be able to do fancy figures, you know, like they see in the movies, great. For fighting, you'll have a full grip. Uh, the proper grip is simply a full grip. Warmon dictates in his, in his text, you know, the little finger touching the knob at the end here. Boom, that's it. Don't overthink it. This is the best way to hold to the club to control the tool, okay. Light clubs or big clubs, it doesn't matter. You want as much control over the club as you can. Again, you know, if you try to do some of the stuff you can do easily with light clubs, try with something heavier and see if you can still do it. Let us know in the comments what you think and uh, we'll catch you in the next video.